Now let's be honest for a second. Moving WhatsApp chats to a new phone shouldn't feel like cracking a secret code. Yet somehow it always does. You finally buy a shiny new smartphone, the excitement is real. Until you remember those year of WhatsApp chats, family group, random memes and that one voice note you absolutely cannot lose. Things get even messier when you are switching between Android and iPhone. Because suddenly the usual backup and restore magic just stops working. Most solution either overcomplicates the process, charge a small fortune or make you nervous about losing data halfway through. And that's exactly where iCareFone transfer steps in. It is designed to take all those chaos and turn it into a simple stress-free process, letting you move your WhatsApp chats, media, even WhatsApp business data between devices without the drama. So now let's jump in and see how this actually works and how you can transfer everything smoothly in no time. Now one of the coolest thing about this tool is how effortlessly it handles cross-platform transfers. It doesn't care whether you are moving from Android to iPhone or the other way around. It just gets the job done. Your chats, photos, videos, call logs and files move along smoothly without random restriction or scary data might loss moments. Now what really seals the deal through is the selective transfer feature. Instead of dumping your entire WhatsApp history onto your new phone, you get to handpick exactly what you want to move. Important chats? Yes. Old forwarded videos you never opened? Hard pass. Now that we have covered what this tool can do, let's move on to the part everyone actually cares about, the real data transfer process. Now first thing first, you will need to download and install the tool onto your computer. I'll drop a download link in the video description so you don't have to go on a Google treasure hunt. Once it is installed, go ahead and just open it up. Now as soon as you launch the tool, you will notice how clean and beginner friendly the interface is. The software supports multiple apps including WhatsApp, WhatsApp Business and even GB WhatsApp which is honestly a nice bonus. Since I'm demonstrating a WhatsApp business transfer from Android to iOS, I will simply select the WhatsApp business option to get started. Next connect both of your phones to the computer using USB cable. Make sure your Android is selected as the source device and your iPhone as the destination. This step matters more than it sounds. At this point your iPhone should connect automatically but if your Android phone doesn't show up, don't worry. Here is how you can fix that. On your Android device, open the setting app, scroll down to about phone and then tap on the build number 7 times. This will enable developer mode. Once that is on, go back to the main setting menu, tap on developer option and turn on USB debugging. Now while you are there, also look for an option called USB configuration and set it to MTP which stands for media transfer protocol. With both phones connected and detected, you are ready to transfer your WhatsApp data. Once that is done, click on transfer button and you are good to go. The tool will give you a quick head up that existing WhatsApp data on the targeted device will be overwritten. Don't panic, just hit continue and the software will begin backing up the WhatsApp data from your Android phone. After the backup starts, you will see a prompt asking you to log into WhatsApp on the target device. This step is crucial because if you skip it, the transfer data will technically be there but completely invisible like a ghost. So simply log into your WhatsApp account and follow the on-screen instruction. Now once everything is done, the tool will finish transferring all your WhatsApp data and show you a successful transfer confirmation screen. Now what really impressed me here is the transfer speed. In our testing, the entire process took around 30 minutes, which is pretty solid considering how much data is being moved. Most importantly, the transfer was reliable, no missing chat, no corrupted media, no weird error halfway through. It's a smooth, efficient and way less stressful than most WhatsApp transfer method out there. Now another really handy feature of this tool is how it simplifies WhatsApp backup and restore. And yes, this is one of those features you don't realize you need until your storage is screaming for help. Instead of filling up Google Drive or iCloud, you can backup your WhatsApp data directly onto your computer, which not only saves cloud storage but also save you a proper offline copy you actually control. For anyone worried about privacy, there is also an encrypted backup option so your chat stays locked up and secure. So whether you are switching phones, recovering lost data or just playing it safe with backups, this feature makes the whole process smoother, smarter and way less frustrating. Alright, now let me break the pricing down in simple terms iCare phone transfer gives you three clear options depending on how long you need it. If you're doing a one-time transfer, the one-month license at $19.95 is the cheapest and the most popular choice. If you want a bit more flexibility, the one-year license costs $39.95 and covers up to five mobile devices on one PC. 
And if you're someone who switches phones often, the lifetime license at $49.95 is a one and done deal. At the end, I just want to say that iCare phone transfer takes the stress out of WhatsApp migration and replaces it with simplicity.